we thank God for another day. Amen. I bring you heavenly greetings in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Today is edition 104 of the ability to see. God has spoken on this subject for two years. He wants his people to have the ability to see everything about demons and be free. Amen. 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 May the heaven in cheer bro, our yes to him. Amen. The Abemba, what to me, who are dear, you know, and nay any far, a tossu or ha, any nine. In fear me, and a yame, a cassafa, sasame, a home. O perse nipper, a who are dear ye, a far a dear biara, a far a dam one home. Now when ya found ye. Amen. Let's hear the heavens report for today. Yentie and there heaven amani bono. When I created Adam and Eve, I gave them my laws for them to see my principles that I demand obedience and loyalty. If anyone speaks a word that is contrary to my written word, and you don't verify from me, you will be deceived. Because I love you and don't want you to be deceived, that is why I have preserved my word for you in order for you to know the truth and be saved. Mm -hmm. So live in the truth of my written word and my enemies can't do anything to harm you. Amen. Thus says the Lord. Amen. Amen. This is Pastor Dr. Kukudazi reporting live from heaven. Amen. Amen. Abraham me bo Adam anyhow no. Me de membran sem ma won. Se de e be ya o be hunu min tintim so ni me hihye ye se me hihye osutie ene ahofama. Se obi ka asembi ne se ne masemu a machro ne boy bra ne se wan shishem en free me wa obe dada o e san se me dou na me pese obi ara be dada o nti enu nti na makura masem se de be ya obe hunu no kware no na wanya nkwa enu nti trase e wo masemu a machro no na matamfo en tumi enya obone Ewa kwa biyaraso. Yes. Weyo sofu Dr. Kuku Dazi. Mamani ba. Midi free heaven. Amen. Amen. Last week. I showed you the seriousness. Of lying. In the name of the Lord God. Almighty. Hmm. Na watu ye chwe mono. Mitra huwa e hupa. Se. Ube diatro. Ewa eradi. Nyankupon tunfono edimu. Yes. If you profess to be a child of God, never lie in God's name. Mm -hmm. true. Be truthful in everything that you do. So we now see se we nyanku pomba me niatro nyami dimu da dinukware ewo wadi biara we mu. That will let you exhibit God's character for Him to be with you. In all your ways. Amen. Enu nebe ma wadan nyanku pon subayi edi. Na ma wakan hon. E wo wakwa yina emu. Amen. If you profess to be a child of God. But remain a liar. You waste your time to go to church. Because you have Satan's character. And that will not let God protect you. Yeah. So who now see say we ye nyanku pomba. Now guswara ye or trofwa. U how hum and now de kwa sorry. A san se uwo o bonsam subain. Na no no e man yame e mo hubain. Lying gives God's people away to demons. 
but God's people don't know. Atro edi nyanku pon enkrofo ema adamoni. En so so nyanku pon enkrofo enim. Demons want God's people to live in lies for God to abandon them so that they will get access into their lives and destroy them. Adamoni pese nyankupon krofo etnasi wo atromu. Na ma nyankupon eja wonho. Na ma wamon soso e nyankwane ako oma brabom ako se won. That scheme started in the Garden of Eden when Satan lied to Eve. And when Eve believed his lies, God abandoned Eve and Adam. And demons got the two of them. Sa na da kwa eno. E shasye wo edin tronu. Wabra obon sam di a troche hawa. Na hawa e je na troche emu di yeno. E ne ma nyan kupon so so e ja o ni adam ho. E ma adam ho ni e nya o mu me eno. That has been the scheme of Satan. He wants God's people to live in his lies. Demons don't want God's people to live in the truth of God. Sa, ena obon sam na da kwa eno, etie. Opese, nyamen kro fo etranse, ewo ono, na tromo. Adamon impese, nyan kupon kro fo, Ebe transi wo nyame eno kwaribu. Until today, people who profess to be gods live in Satan's lies. It is as if living in lies has been the order of the day. Na besine, enipa wamu nesye se wamu ye nyame nkrofono. Wamu tiasi. Ewo obon sam atrom. Na amana kamia ye se. Atromu wa ena omotie. The way church people behave today. It's as if they can't live in truth. And tell the truth. Said ye. Asori efu obinum. Eye wonema enemre mo yin. E kamia ye said ye. Omu ntumi ntransi wa nukwari mo. Na wamu nsansu so enka nukwari. They say that everyone is lying. So if they decide to tell the truth, they will be victimized. Wamu kase, ubiya e diatro. Anunti, se wamu kwa ye wamu se wamu be kano kwa rea. Ase wamu be sore eti ya wamu. That is speaking as someone who wants to survive, not as someone who wants to be saved by God and be with Him forever in heaven. Yes, yeah. If you want God to protect you and save you from the hellfire, don't follow the world. Live according to the character of God. Amen. So, I'm saying, I'm going to say, 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 I'm going don't have any protection from God. No matter what they get, they will die and go to hell anyway. Omo omo transia, omo pe e kwen biya omo be faswa, omo brabono e be kosono. Omo ni bambo biya amfinya meo. Em fa hondi omo be nye biya, omo be u no ma kobo samje. So ponda, Lying to survive and dying to go to hell and telling the truth 
for God to protect you and be with you forever, which one is better? Enunti jenehu. So who di atro? Na ma wa tumi atransi wa abrabo mono. Na wa u edi akobo semjim. Eni se, ube kanu kware. Na ma nyanko pon abo hubayin. No akan huwa fi bo no. Diye wohin ene yepa. When Daniel lived in truth among liars during the reign of King Darius, God protected him when the liars plotted evil against him and he was cast into the den of lions in the book of Daniel chapter 6. Wabra Daniel tina atrufumu ewo ohini Darius abresonu nyankupon bon hubayin Wabra atrufonu e bon hupo boni na otu ni chini jata e buumunu. Ewa Daniel ngomano ti insiano. He came out of the lion's den and head. But when the liars who accused Daniel were thrown into the same den of lions, them, their children, and their wives were overpowered by the lions. They broke all their bones into pieces before they even went to the bottom of the den. Mm -hmm. In Daniel chapter 6, verse 24. Amen. O free jata buonu mu pie ya ni hu antoche ma biara. Nansu su wabra atrofono u cha sem tu Daniel sunu. O tu womu ekogu jata buonu manu. Womu, woma, Enu wa hile nu mendru jatabu wa nu mwasi hompo. Ene nyatano ri wa mbubu wa nu mpe mwingina. Ema wawuye. Ewa dani ya ngomano. Tinsi ya chichemu edionu nae. Because of their lies, they didn't have the protection of God. Woma trundi na wawumu ni nyankupo mbambo biya. When you are among liars and because of money and position, you decide to join them in their lies, a situation will come when God will not protect you. So, fra a true form, na sika, any dibienti, udo huko fra fra, woma tron, na usu yo true form, asembi beba, nyankupon emma hubai. So weigh the options and choose one. And then to walk karini me no na yi asem no mu ba Do you want to be a liar and perish forever or you want to live and tell the truth and live forever? O pese o yo trufo na o shi afibo. Ana se o be transe wo no kware mu aka no kware na wa transe afibo. When you decide to live in truth, God will protect you from evil people as he did for Daniel and all his truthful children. Amen. 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 By God's divine provision, when you tell the truth, you will always eat. Amen. It's saying, Nyame adebia oma ni ma di e hiya yen enti no. Se usi e jane se debia ube kano kware ya. Debia ube didi. Losing God's protection and dying to burn forever in the hellfire. It's what those who like to survive don't know. So washi nyanku pon bambo. Na wo wu ako shia fi bo wo obun sam jenu mono. Ena wona wo di atro na odi transi wa brabo mono. Woni mono. If you think it's better to lie and survive, your mind is rotting because of money. You are a shallow-minded person. 
se eye wajin se eye se ubedi atro na mwotu midi atransia si kenti wajina se na unye nipa wajina mudo the Lord God Almighty who created everything does not want his people to live in the lives of Satan at all Radin yami tu mfwa obo adie ina anu em pese ni mkro fwo be chansi e wo obo nsam atro mkra he wants his children to live in the truth he tells amen o pese ni mkro fwo chansi e wo no kwaria o kanumu that was why he told Adam in Genesis chapter 2 verse 17 that the day that he eats from the forbidden tree, he will surely die. And you didn't catch Adam. I will most of my dick and team, you know, teach a moo, do so on a say. A da, or bet a diabano be a free dianoa, what brano no asono, no quarrying, a wona or be woo. But sadly, when Satan lied to Eve that. She and Adam will not surely die. They believed Satan's lies. Oh. oh. Now, Rahul 7 said, Wabra, upon some dear trotter, how I said, or no, ne Adam, nya dear, umbe ubian, umu koji, upon some atrono, edi. That is how Satan has caused God's people to live in his lies. As if lying is normal oh. till today. Mm. Lying is the order of the day. Sana obon sama yama nyanku pankro fo etiasi ewo atromu ena akami aye te se de atro de udibia anya we sana ekoso. Tinti ama be te se abraba aye boy de e atro na obi ade. The minds of liars are destroyed by Satan. Obun sam as say atrofo nina again. To liars, it is very difficult to tell the truth yeah. and live in truth, mm. especially when everyone is lying. Mm. That is how they think. Atrofo patch they say, edipa. Se obeka no kware na wa chansi nsu wa no kware mo. Titru se obia e diatra. Sana wa majun ya wa. To such church people, if everyone is lying, then lying is not a big deal. Che se diye sa asore fwa ni pachere ni se. Se obia e diatra diya. Ani ena atro diye no. Ani ya diye mwa mwa biya. Hmm. That is why such people don't have any guilt when they lie to deceive others. Mm. And as I said early on, they only look at their survival. Mm. Mm. They are one-sided people. Yes. They don't know the consequences of lying. Omu ye nipa, omu sha die e fri e famba kope. Omu nim in sunsanswa a tro die no ediba. Let me ask those who think that there is nothing wrong with lying some questions. Oma aye oma jin se odi atra mfomso biara eni hono ma me mise bi sa omo nsemfo bi As a young woman who lies to survive what will you do when you get pregnant and the time comes for you to deliver a baby at the hospital and your breath is leaving you Can you call on God whose truthful life you have abandoned Eh? Hmm. Hmm. 
se ababa wa wo di atro na wo die e na wo de bo abra bo no se wo fa afro na mra so se wo ko ayare sabia na wo de ko wo abofra no na sa wo bre mu no wo home e pa na afro mu na wo wa eti wo betu me afra nyankopan wa ne no kware abra bo no wapo no ana and as a young man who also lies and cheats people to survive when you are diagnosed with an incurable disease can you call on god to heal you and i say a branch and so on so so dear throw now that down crawford said you bear out the better transit say doctor for catch you say ya reboni bia ya saa enye ya ba uni pedue mwa ube tumye suwa fre nyame sa wansa wa yari adana and as a politician who claims to be a christian but constantly lies cheats and takes bribes when there is a sudden catastrophe will you be safe eh ena se we are myonia una o si ese we are christoni na nso da bia tro na wudi na o da dan krofo na o si sin krofo na o ji ademode no se mputu prumu suo bi ne se bi sikin kenya nti wo be fa ho tototo akodi ana lion has been in the fabric of societies and everyone lies atro ajinhi ewo timamfo emu na obi a edi atro so if a politician lies to deceive people in order to get votes and doesn't feel ashamed that the citizens will see him as a liar it doesn't surprise me and then the say o mayoni edi atro edi dada ndipa say the ebeya wo mu beto aba e di amanu na se enye na ni hu se ti ma mu fo be hu no se o yo trofo a enye me nwa nwakura and if non christian citizens also lie and cheat people it doesn't amaze me because they exhibit the characters of satan who lives in them yeah and that's it ti ma mu fo so o nya christo fo so no wo di atro no mo so si synchrofo a eno so so e ma me hun dwere me kra e san se wo mo dan satan oti wo mo mu no suban no edi but if a professing christian lies it is a big deal yeah because that does not reflect the character of god yeah ne mom se nipa o na si e so ye christo ni no Odi atro dia ende ya asem kasi pa e san se no no enda nyankopon suban edi yes when church people lie it really disturbs me because it brings the name of the lord into disrepute se asori for di atro e ha me pa e san se e di urade din ba enimti ebo mu lying makes satan happy it makes him tell god that you see they all love my character oh. they don't like your truth it's very sad eh yeah, ah, very very sad atro e ma bu sama ni je na ma ni ka che yakopon se se o hu o mu ya permiso ban na omo mpe wono kwaero so if you profess to be a child of god don't make satan happy by living in his lies yeah i don't ti wona o si ese wo ye nyankopon ba memma obonsam ene nje wa bra wo tanse wo na trom some people have believed satan's lies to establish churches to think that there is no hell and there is no judgment after death hmm. hey. satan 
has fooled such people big time. Ebinum aji obun sama tro edi. Amo omo di atitin sorry ama ye omo ajin se. Obun sami jembi e ni ho. Na owe chi atem wobi ansoso e ni ho. Obun sam e jimi sanko fonu okwan ke siye soba. As I said last week, the conscience of such people are seared with hot iron. So they don't read the Bible to find out the truth. Yes. Na said the American na ochi e chair mono. Sanko fono. Ye di ayo a shia pa to o my jrene so amana she. I don't ti omon kin kan ya mia se mumpo no mu de hono kwaru. It is either such people don't want to read the Bible to find out the truth, or they just Want to hold on mm. to the lies of Satan? Mm. Yes. Say yes, sir. Some confirming person, we must be in the Bible. No one dare who no call no. Any and any yes, sir. We must pray. We must cry at throne. We must some catch the one on Kwamu. It is written in Hebrews chapter nine, verse twenty-seven, that it is appointed for men, meaning humanity, to die once. And after that judgment, yeah. What you are Hebrew for, Mama Tim Crow, Chichemu, a Dionun son, say, a chasset, a nipper beer, a whoop, precope, Nanuachino, Atemo. So God will bring whatever you are doing now into judgment. Yes. And when the idea of beer, we are in the sea, Mono. Nyan coupon de beba atemo. Mm-hmm. And concerning hell, it is the Lord Jesus Himself who stated plainly in Matthew chapter 10, verse 28, that He is able to destroy both the soul and body in hell. Yeah. And in Matthew chapter 8, verse 12, 13, verse 42. And 13 verse 50, the Lord again describes hell as the outer darkness and the furnace of fire where there will be weeping, wailing, and gnashing of teeth. Yes. All these scriptures denote that there is a place of punishment prepared by God to punish sinners eternally. Yes. Called yes. hell. hell. Mm. Now, Efa Obon Sam Jano Ehonsono, a year Radi Yasu Christo, no Ankasa, and no Kani Pefe, O Matio Sempatidu, Chichemu, a Duno, what can I say? O Betumia say ni Pediano, and no Crano, a Obon Sam Jano. Nasa Oba Matio Sempa, T Mochi, Chichemu Dumienu. Ti du miensa, chiche mu e du anami enu. Eni ti du miensa, chiche mu e du anami enu soa. E radi yesu kristo gu soa e dan, obon sam janu mu e di se. E ye e chile yi, e shimunu e mu. Eni e ja, e shibruburua. E ni padaseni, e cha jo. Na wo su, na wo chere wansi. San se mfwe ina a chese se. Bia ebi wo ha nyankopon asiesia ode be che adebon ye fo aso afebo a ye fre no obonsam ja so no one can dispute the fact that there is a place called hell and make the lord jesus christ a liar yes anunti obi to me ji achi ni se bia bia ni ho a ye fre no obonsam ja Na ma eradi yesu kristo aye atrofo. Mm. When you say that there is no hell and there is no judgment after death, you make the Lord Jesus Christ a liar mm. and Satan truthful. Mm. But the Bible says in Romans chapter 3 verse 4 that let God be true and every man a liar. Yes. God does 
must not lie. As I told you last week. So who can say? Obon Sam Jabia Niho. Na o word so a chin so a temu obia ni honswa. Uma eradi yesu Christo yo trofo. No bon sam ye no kwafo. Nan so so watro roman for humano. Timi and san chiche moon nine se. Mani paina yo trofo. Nen yanko pon kwa en yanu kwafo. Sadia me kanu na wat ye tre mono. Nyan kupon e ni atro. If you belong to the church that does not believe that there is an eternal place of torment called hell, answer this question. So Doma Soria, Womu Yini say, A suchi be a bi wa fi boa ye freno e ja enumidanu dea. Mi peso yi san se me anu. Can the Lord Jesus, who created everything, talk about a place that does not exist? Mm. Eh? Can he? Mm. No. And to me, I say, a radius to Christa, or bo a dear yinano, I can't be a beer anywhere at once a man. Is the Lord Jesus Christ a liar? A radius to Christo or your truth for now. If you see the Lord Jesus Christ as a liar, what is your organization about? Eh? So who a radius to Christo said or your truth for who could a fadiabe? How do you call your organization? And in whose name do you pray? Ukuono, who friend is saying, Namu bompaya, a wine dimu, and a mobo. If any preacher makes the Lord Jesus Christ a liar, it is obvious that his organization is not a church. Mm -hmm. Because church was brought about by the Lord Jesus Christ. Se osempakani biya hu eradi Yesu Kristo se o your trofo. Eni ene de di pefe se ni kuno enye asore. Yeah. E sansa asore di e eradi Yesu Kristo ene de baye. Such an organization is a demonic one. Sa e kuno e ya demoni ku. They are using the name of the Lord Jesus. But at the same time, make him a liar. That's why I always say their minds don't function well. Yeah. How can you use the name of the Lord Jesus Christ to make profit and at the same time see him as a liar? Yeah. It is only a madman who do that. Yes. Yes. Mm. A bad day na when you ready Jesus Christ to home fast oh no we are no answer who is all your trouble who is an intern because our major in your jumano but damn for one corner better it is only liars as the preacher who will join themselves together yes yes a true for one corner it is a Osen Pakeni no and we make a we move a bomb sir. And do you think you can establish a church and make the Lord Jesus Christ who created you a liar and go scot free? Hey. Eh? Now, I hear what you say. Ube to me, atikua friend, I'm sorry. Now, I'm a radi Jesus Christ, I'm a boy, 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 I'm a boy. No. He will punish you severely. For making him a liar. Yeah. Maybe what God did to Korah and his company is not in their Bible. Hmm. If they have read about what God did to them, they wouldn't play the fool yes. with the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Mm-hmm. So, all my Bible, no more kind of common fat, a radius to crystal ding, and young Cassia some cra, no more cassa at the city of your truffle. 
when people live in lies, they lose their senses of reasoning. Yeah. It's true. They only live in the lies Satan tells them and don't reason well. The Lord God Almighty who called Israel from Egypt and gave them his laws clearly stated through prophet Jeremiah in the book of Jeremiah chapter 31 verse 31 that he was going to make a new covenant with the house of Israel and Judah. A radinya mi tumfoa o fra Israel for a free Muslim no. Now the name man say ma wo no. O kan pefe a tre Israel for e fa o di for Yeremia mu. E wo Yeremia nwoma no. Ti aduasa ba ko. Tiche mu aduasa ba ko se. Oni Israel eni Judah e ba be ye apamfofro. And in Mark chapter 14, verse 22 to 24, when the Lord was eating supper with the disciples and gave them the cup to drink from it, he said, This is my blood of the new covenant, which is shed for many. Now, Mark was saying, wa bra na urade ani asuafo no edidie no na o ma won kru wa no se wonum enfri mo no o ka se we ni mi moja e fa apam fufro no e hu a mi hwie gu ama nipa bebre it implies that the death of the lord jesus christ on the cross brought about the new covenant as ye tse se E wu a radi Yesu Christo wu a senu ya nasu no. E nu ne di apamfufro no e ba ye. And for saying a new covenant in Hebrews chapter 8 verse 13 it denotes that the Lord God Almighty made the old covenant obsolete. Na se o kan se apamfufro e wo Hebrew fwa ngu manu ti mo chi Tiche mu du mi ensan enso no. Asi e tre se. E rade nyan koupon tu mfo. E cha apam dada no emu. Indicating that. The church. The Lord Jesus Christ established. Operates in the new covenant now. And the old one is abolished. Na asi e e tre se. Asori ya e rade yesu kristo te ye no. E di juma e wo apam fufro no. Na da da no de. O chem. Yet. Some people have believed in the lies of Satan. To establish churches. To do things in the old covenant. Mm. As if the old one is still in force. Mm. So so. En krofo binu ma ji obon sa ma tro no e di. E di a titin sore. Na oye ni ema e wo apam dada no mo. E ma kamia e se. Apam dada no. E gusua e ye juma. There are many churches. That operate in Satan's lies. So if you don't open your eyes wide. And read the Bible well. You will be deceived. And sorry be brave wo wa. Wo mo e di won juma wo. Obon sam atom. And it is one year when he year pa and shen ye may ye. No one sounds so unkind Bible ye pa. Obedada. In the New Testament church of the Lord Jesus Christ, we don't burn incense in the church. We don't light candles and teach the members to abstain from certain foods. War a radi yes to Christ to a sorry noir. A war upon Fufrono Emono Yan she a shed, a was sorry them Yan Susso candle 
and I yen sans so soon che as a for manu say, a diani be wa, ma womuni. We don't baptize infants. We baptize adults who have believed the gospel of Jesus Christ and have repented from their sins. Ye mo emotafwa esu. Ye bo mpenimfwa. Waji eradi Yesu Christo asempano edi. Na wasakra wageno esu. Yet some people still believe in the lies of Satan and settled in the Old Testament churches where they still burn incense, light candles, baptize infants, and perform some rituals as if we are still under the old covenant. Nansusu, ini pebidum eguswara aji obonsama tro edi na oma transiwo apam dada ensorinum a omu guswara shishi eshe I was all them all. Omu suso suso candles. Na omu bo emotafwa esu. Na omu ye ye nyankuma dibi. Eti said ye ye guswara wo apam dadano emu. It is amazing, eh? How demons have deceived intellectuals to accept such teachings to belong to such churches without any question. It amazes me, eh? Mama pa, o kwa ya damon yetu mi afaswa. Wada da ni pa o ni mama jing. Namu waji sanche chena tum. Na odi wa mu wa kodom sanso no. Wabra wo misa zembiya. Anyway, I'm not surprised because when it comes to Satan's lies and deception, it doesn't matter if you are even a professor. Yes. Na enye mi wa mama pi esanse. Se ba obon sa ma tron eni ni na da kwa. Se uye o kounin wa di si yon mou. E o si yon pon moun pokra a. En fa hon. Obe ti mea da da wo. He can easily fool you. If you don't read the Bible. To cross check. The doctrines of a church. Se u nye obi a o kan e Bible. Na u shi she mou she. A sorry bi jidi a. O mou di jina so pa a. Satan wants to keep such people bound so that they will not catch up with the Lord Jesus. Upon some person or teacher, some go for no pa. Said the Bayer, when he eradi Jesus Christ to emom into an amom. My question for such churches is: Are you doing your own thing, or you are worshiping God? According to his directions. Mm. Eh? Eh? Ma se mwa. Mi bisa sa an sore ni se. Mo ye mo an kasa mo adyebi. Ana se. Mo nam nyanku po an kasa akwan chre so. E na mo de so mwa. If you are doing your own thing. Why then do you call your organization church? Eh? As if you follow God's instructions. Eh? Eh? Ne se mou ye mou anka sa mou a diye bidi ya. A de nti e na mou kou no mou fre na sore. Na mou man a kami a ti se diye. Nyanko pon shi shi e na mou diye chile. Any church that is not synonymous with the New Testament church of the Lord Jesus Christ is fake. Dr. Kukudazi said that. A sore biara. E nti se a panfu fra sore noa. Eradi Yesu Christo ti ye biara no. Sa sore no nyan sore papa. Dr. Kuku da zi nekan ye. And in Mark chapter 16 verse 17. The Lord Jesus said that. These signs will follow those who believe in him. In his name we will cast out demons. We will speak with new tongues. And lay hands on the sick, and they shall recover. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Ena wama kwa sempa ti dunsi ya chichemu dunsi onsono. Eradi Yesu Christo kanse. En sentre ni bedi wana wajini dieno echi. Ni demon 
yebe tutu ahumboni yebe ka kasafufro yedi ensabe gu ayari fosu na wangu beye wante again there are some churches that believe in satan's lies and don't believe in casting out of demons hmm. speaking in tongues and divine healing ebio hmm. ye won sori bi ho a wo ji obun sama tro no di na se ye tutu ahohun boni afri nipam ana se ye ka kasa fofro ana se nyankopon ayare sakron kron de wonyi ni to the leaders of such churches demons should still remain in people yeah. hey yeah. hey that's yeah. what they mean <laughs> Dear Akandifua, I was answering more partially say, Adam on the Muswa and Tetra de Pemu. Hey! <laughs> and a church that was established by a genuine servant of God has now directed that any pastor who prays to cast out demons from the church members hmm. should be expelled from the church. Hey! hey. hey. It's serious, oh! Very, very, very serious. serious. Now, Asoria. Nyankupo akwa kind pa and a tea yeno. Say say oh my si shemra se or sofu bia or bob bompaye a tu twa hum bone efri asafumano emono wen yin a di inflas. My god the church has completely fallen into the hands of demonic surrogates. Just as solen ako she a damoni. I see a name for them. Mm. There are some churches who don't want to speak in tongues and have divine healing. Mm. Hey, you want sorry be wah? Omo pesa omo beka kasa fufro na omo nyia ayarsa krum krum. When God says He is our healer, they don't believe it. Se nyangu pon kase onuni yeyarsa fwa. Satan doesn't want such people to have divine healing. Mm. And strangely, they have accepted it. Mm. Hey! Mm. To them, divine healing is a thing of the past. The Omo Pachel say, let me continue to ask them some questions. Mami muswa mise bisa omun semfobi. Do demons still exist? If they do exist, do they continue to do evil to people? I want them to answer that question. Enti adamoni omu oho. Na se omu owa omu gusua omu ye boni tie nipa na bebese sanko fo no omu yi sanse me an do demons still do evil to people by putting evil diseases on them and killing them painfully do they still do that e ti adamo ni gusua e ye boni tie nipa wa brom di yare boni egu nipa so na o ku o wo ya o supa o nya ya na e gu su koso won time is fast spent god will in next week i'll come and continue my message but the message today is simple satan wants people to live in his lies so if you want to be with god forever open your eyes read the bible and find the truth or else you believe in Satan's lies and burn forever in hell. So be wise. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I want you to be wise by giving your life to Jesus as you pray this prayer with me. Me pesa uye nyansani wabra udi wabra boma eradi Yesu Christo. Na one mi bosa ampaye. Lord Jesus. I thank you for speaking to me today. 
I accept that I am a sinner. But from this day forward, I believe in my heart and confess with my mouth that Jesus, you are the only Lord. Yes, forgive me of all my sins. And write my name in the book of life. Let your Holy Spirit dwell in me. And I will live a holy life to praise you. Thank you for saving me. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Father, thank you for speaking to open the eyes of people. So that they will not live in the lies of Satan to burn forever in hell. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Bon sem jem akwan soa. Shisha ya chila akwan. Ewo kase. Kase ewo kumase. Na main road. Wawbe hunu se. E kwan ho ho na. Goyal feeling station. Ewo main road ho. Goyal feeling station. No se usi ewo station wa. Ninche mu e kwan sa da. Ninche mu sa ne kofom. Who could draw from who chaya uncle baby a buma? Who be who say ye iron gate so we are true ye signboard a bosso. I won't send you for so. Action Power Faith Ministries. Ye sofu penny. Reverend Doctor Kukudazi. Enna ene odin senpei ebreo ewo AP Radio 105.7. Na ene anopei e ye non kron. Ukwada enyumrinu unumnifan so eye Bible adisuya. Ene fiada enyumrinu unumnifan enso eye mpaibo. Na ye papa e chre chri yemu. Bonsam e kwa ya ufa asuwa. Wadi ma adam eni fushia se e wa atrobu. Ene natronu a wadi eme ni pa fia se e gusu ye juma. Na bisa ohon se ene wedi atrobu redudu wa se Say ye phone so. Say ye a sem kem. Say ye si kasem mu. E kwa ye bi ya so. Say ye nko mudie mu. Atro say na wedi. Uso fro hon kristo ni. Ne e bidi mu kura se mu amon kane se. E politician si di atro. E ye amen peni fwe di atro. E nyuma ye fwe di yin peni fwe nyine di atro. Inti mi di bi ye nye she. Ni ye papa kan se. Wajirin ye o se ubi ye e di bi. Ti misu mi di nam di a survival. Na ubi sa hon. Se wuwa, sa ankrofo na bubo wundi, no mne bebu wa tenyana. Wamu ndiye, wamu ni mne se, obi ya wo di atro, efe si ka hon fa mpeni ya, ya di ne si biya 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 hon. Atro biya wo di, obi bu wa ten. Enti wo so, jino mo so wo di ya hon. Obi ya ni hwa wo ye kristo ni ya, wo di atro, na wakwe na meho. Se di ya papa kan, daniya, ni wamu abeba hwa sem no. Omu di no kre, ni e to, da ni e to, ya te bu omu no, nyami yi no. E nu ti di no kre, ne nyami yi wate. Na atura, ebe yu ya si sabre no, anu o te, di e yama re o kukura, kese kese ne se. Di e ba e bula kani pe fe, na empe nifu, empe nifu bi a tweste no. Na o niya a o fro o mu, o sofwe. O si mi en tutu a hon hon mwane. Na ni e ma bi shabe suwa be de me hon en ne. Me ya me hosu ye nye ye. Na me kwe mkwa me ba e ma. Na mi hi o jie. Na o si mi e tutuwa hon hon mwane. So u ye hwane. Ha? U ye juma ama hwane. E nye demons na u ye juma ama wamo na apesa o chumi kubu. O niyo tu hufo. E ye wu. E na obe kwa kwe jire nyami e nime bu aten. O bie ni hwa no ma. O be jew. U ye be kwa na ankure mkure. E niti june hon. Se. Be bi a wote no. E jew. E be bu hao. And now say, eh, chua kwa bwa nsa minche. Hell, nye baby, eh, di di a grow da. Eh, ye, one time, mwun kwa nsa ma, no chance. Nti bra, uwa chance, ye bra, uti a si. Jino, da, nyami, shra, upa. Amen. Amen. Amen, mama. Onu ya, eh, ye, ye, bre, eh, radi, pesu, wa, jiu, unkwa. O, pesu, wa, jiu, fri, o, bwa nsa ma, at, 
tro a onam nsori mu edi chran kofo no my dear in these end times god wants to set you free from the lies satan is telling some people in some churches yeah. come to action power i keep telling you that you will be established in the truth no one can deceive you you can stick your head out and say that if the lord jesus is coming down today mm-hmm. you will be with him yeah. that is what action power is about and if any demon is in your body we have power to cast them out man we serve the lord jesus christ who worked the same miracles you read about in the bible yes that is why he wants me to tell the whole world that with god all things are possible god bless you god bless you